What's up YouTube? Hey, I'm here at my storage unit right now getting ready to put my boat up. And I figured before I covered her up for a little nap that I'd uh, take you on a little tour of it. So, here we go. She is a 2000 model Nitro 911 CDC. I uh, looked for a long time for this boat. It's, a, it's kind of a collector's item in that it's got one unique feature in that it's a center console fiberglass boat. So I looked for years for one of these that someone had taken good care of and I found it up by Lake of the Ozarks and had to make about a seven hour drive to go pick it up. So let's start up at the front shall we? Alright I have got the blue water LED navigation lights on the bow. I've got a motor guide 80 pound thrust trolling motor. We have got a, I've got the decket mount here that I put my HDS 8 on that I have a structure scan system on. I've installed a cool foot on my uh, trolling motor pedal. And by the way, on these decket mounts, you can see the brand right there. This is, uh, in my opinion, much better than a ram mount, and it's about half the price. Check them out on Tackle Warehouse. Um, let's look here. Here, I'll jump up in the boat so I can show you guys some stuff. Got the nice carpet graphic that my wife made for me for Christmas with our last name. Um, as you can tell, the, the deck on this boat is absolutely huge. Um, it's got two nice big rod lockers. It's got the retractable cleats or rod straps, whatever you want to call them. Big storage compartments. I actually use these two for all my tackle. Um, and I have I have taken all the bulbs out and put LEDs inside all of my compartments so they're real bright at night. Here's where I keep my bumpers, my life vest, our dog's life vest. Keep all that up here on the front. Boat has to has a pedestal seat and a fishing seat <clears throat> and I keep the pedestal right here just so I can sit on it and use it as like a bait tying station. Oh, another unique feature about this boat is in the front floor, it's got a third live well. Um, so if you wanted to, I actually plug it and use it as a cooler. It's got four cross seating, and uh, I got tired of people stepping on my outside seats. So I took them off and just got down to the bare little plastic pad there, which makes a nice step. You got grab handles there on the sides. So right here, you've got your center console, which is a little dirty right now. I have I had a tournament Tuesday night and haven't had a chance to clean it. Throttle control in the middle with trim. You've got tilt wheel, nice instrument cluster right there. Right here is where I mount another HDS-8 in between my screens uh, with a structure scan system. All of your live well controls. So glove box. I've got a CD player in this boat. A little Boss CD player, MP3 player that I put in it. Um, underneath your seats, I have storage under this one and a cooler underneath this one. Your back deck. You have big storage compartments with lift out trays. Have the Guardian live wells that you can see my ardent smart calls down in there for tournaments. Um, I love the back compartments on these nitros because I got everything nicely laid out there. I got access to all my batteries, my oil reservoir. You can see the pumps back there along the back wall of the boat. So it makes working on stuff real easy. There's my rear navigation light easy to get to 
Um, so yeah, the back decks on these boats are monstrous, so is the front deck. Oh, she sits on a uh, nitro tandem axle trailer with the nice five spoke rims on it, the diamond plate steps. I've put LED tail lights and everything on it. Um, <clears throat> it's got a Mercury 225 Opti, and I've put, uh, I had Daryl at Iguana Graphics. Which y'all, if y'all haven't used him, you should check him out. He made me these custom graphics for the motor. They're a, a carbon fiber red pattern, which goes real nicely with the boat. It's got a right height jack plate on it and a 25 pitch Mercury Tempest Plus. Um, guys, the boat here is not, she's not real fast. Um, top speed with two guys in it's about 66 miles an hour takes her sweet time getting on plane but the thing I like about the boat <coughs> um, with the center consoles is I get everywhere safe and dry and uh, I mean we've had this thing on some humongous water and uh, and she does great um, with it being such a wide boat it's over eight feet wide um, it handles the big chop really, really well. So, um, what else can I tell you about this boat? Oh, I've put, I had Daryl make these, the Nitro logos. I've put those on brand new. And the CDC logos. I don't know if you can see them or not. Anyway, this is, this is my rig. Um, Nitro 911 CDC love the boat and uh you guys thanks so much for watching and we will uh talk to y'all later